Hey everyone, this is Sarah from Multnomah County Democrats, and today we're going to talk about our local government. Here in Multnomah County, we are served by three different kinds of local governments. We have the Metro Government, which is a multi-county agency centered around the Portland metropolitan area, and we have the Multnomah County Government. Within our county, the cities of Portland, Fairview, Gresham, Maywood Park, Troutdale, and Wood Village each have their own city government as well. Today we're going to discuss the structure of these three bureaus so that you can better understand how your government works and what an impact your vote and participation in local politics has on your everyday life here in Multnomah County, Oregon. Metro Government is a multi-county agency serving parts of Multnomah, Clackamas, and Washington counties. The purpose of Metro is to work together across county lines to manage issues of development, public services and utilities, and preservation of natural resources, among other issues that impact the Portland metropolitan area. Metro was established in 1979 following decades of interest in regional planning and management and evolving out of two similar former agencies. Metro manages a number of regional parks, cemeteries, and recycling and waste management centers, among other services. Metro also coordinates regional planning around land use and development and is responsible for the creation and management of iconic Portland spaces, such as the Oregon Zoo, Expo and Convention Centers, and the Portland Five Centers for the Arts. Every four years, citizens of our three counties elect one Metro President, one Metro Auditor, region-wide, as well as six Metro Councilors who are elected by district in nonpartisan races. The Multnomah County Government manages important public services such as marriage and business licenses, public health clinics, public records, property taxes, and more. They also offer public assistance for low-income residents, as well as those with addiction or mental health issues, or those experiencing homelessness, among other resources to support health and safety. The officials we elect in the county government are the chair, four commissioners who are elected by district, an auditor, as well as our sheriff and district attorney. The chair and commissioners oversee the various administrative departments and create the annual county budget. The district attorney is responsible for prosecuting those who violate state law within our county. The sheriff oversees law enforcement as well as jails and corrections facilities in our county. All of these positions are elected every four years in nonpartisan races. The cities of Fairview, Gresham, Maywood Park, and Troutdale each elect a city government consisting of a mayor and four to six city council members. The city of Wood Village does not have a mayor and instead elects five city council members. The city of Portland elects a mayor and four city commissioners who make up the city council as well as a city auditor. All positions serve four-year terms and are elected in nonpartisan races. Portland is actually the last remaining large city in the U.S. which still has a commission form of government. A commission government is unique in that its members have legislative, administrative, and quasi-judicial powers. For example, the Portland City Council passes city laws and budgets, directly oversees city bureaus and carries out policy, as well as hears testimony in certain land use appeals. In addition to city governments, there are a number of smaller, special districts whose officials we elect as a part of local government. For example, there are the East and West Multnomah Soil and Water Conservation Districts, which each focus on soil health, environmental and agricultural education, invasive plant management, and keeping water clean for the benefit of local farmers and all of us. The Rockwood People's Utility District is an independent district that provides drinking water to Portland, Gresham, and Fairview. Other special districts include public school boards, community college boards, fire protection districts, and water districts. Because this is your local government, there are so many ways to get involved. 
Besides voting for your elected representatives, most of these governments have ways where you can give testimony, share ideas, or even suggest legislation. And you can always volunteer or, better yet, run for office. You can also get appointed to advisory bodies and commissions. Sign up for updates for a bureau that you care about and you'll be the first to hear about openings. You can have a key role in making decisions that impact your community. This coming election, vote. Do the research. Figure out which candidates you support. After the election, keep them accountable to create laws and policies that are equitable and serve the public good. If you'd like to know who our Democratic candidates are this year, check out the link below. Fellow Oregonian, voting is your constitutional right. Use it. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like this video, share with friends, and give us a follow below for more videos that empower you in your role as a Multnomah County Democrat.